हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल सो गाइस टुडेज एजेंडा वुड बी वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी ओके हाउ यू कैन क्रिएट अ फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी एंड आफ्टर दैट हाउ कैन यू कैन क्रिएट अ फ्लैट फाइल स्कीमा लाइक रिकॉर्ड विथ द नो आईडी इन सॉफ्टवेयर एजी वेब मेथड टेन पॉइंट फिफ्टीन सो ले स्टार्ट द डेमो सो बेसिकली वी नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड वॉट इज मीन बाय फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी ओके सो फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी इज अ सिंपली अ रिपोजिटरी फॉर एलिमेंट्स दैट यू रेफरेंस फ्रॉम अ फ्लैट फाइल स्कीमा लाइक वाइज वंस यू क्रिएट अ फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी ओके इन स्कीमा यू विल रेफरेंस टू दैट पर्टिकुलर फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी ओके सो दिस अलाउस यू टू क्रिएट अ रिकॉर्ड डेफिनेशन इन अ डिक्शनरी एंड दैट कैन बी यूज अक्रॉस मल्टीपल फ्लैट फाइल स्कीमा ओके एंड इट विल ऑल्सो रिड्यूसेज द अमाउंट ऑफ अ मेमोरी कंज्यूम बाय अ फ्लैट फाइल स्कीम ओके सो इन अ फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी इन इन केस लेट से दे आर हैविंग सम अपडेशन इन अ फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी ओके सो वंस यू अपडेट योर फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी नो नीड टू अपडेट योर फ्लैट फाइल स्कीम इट विल डिरेक्टली रिफ्लेक्टेड इन योर मल्टीपल फ्लैट फाइल स्कीम सो दैट इज अ बेसिक बेनिफिट ऑफ द फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी ओके सो लेट स्टार्ट द डेमो हाउ यू कैन फर्स्ट यू क्रिएट द फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी सो हियर आई क्रिएटेड वन फ्लैट फाइल डेमो पैकेज अंडर दैट फ्लैट फाइल डेमो दिस इज माई फोल्डर एंड फ्लैट फाइल एफ एफ डिक्शनरी वन दिस इज अ अनादर फोल्डर ओके सो जस्ट राइट क्लिक न्यू क्लिक ऑन अ फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी हियर यू कैन गिव द नेम एज अ बुक फ्लैट फाइल डिक्शनरी देन फिनिश okay here you can see the option record definition composite definition and a field definition okay here record definition just right click new and you can give the name as a catalog okay after that catalog this is record definition then click on right click new and select field definition option okay here there are two extract extractor type like field definition like fixed depth position and n field okay so as per your requirement you can select the option so i am selecting this n field and uh, let me go into the flat file here the first field definition would be your id by using this option you can add a row by using this option you can delete a row and by using this option you can insert a row okay so i am expecting the add row option okay now id first name then second your country then just copy third would be your accessories accessory paste it here then your inv id it means invoice id then requirement then model and then mobian okay so this is extra field you can delete it always uh, you need to mention your mandatory and optional field okay so in my case id this is my mandatory field inv id invoice id my mandatory field or there are optional and position always start from 0 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 okay now click on finish and save the dictionary first okay so once dictionary got created then right click new and flat file schema we need to create so give the name as a book flat file schema next here you can see two option create manually create from sample file we don't have a sample file so i just selecting this option so you will get to know how you can uh, selecting the record uh, delimiter parser type and as all well, okay so select this option create manually and then finish here we need to select the delimiter first because in our flat file contain a delimiter and character this is a new line so to jumping the new line we require this character 
एंड फील्ड और कंपोजिट वी हैव अ कॉम ओके अकॉर्डिंग टू द डू दैट दे यू नीड टू सेलेक्ट योर द नेंड फील्ड ओके नाउ योर नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट स्टेप वुड बी गो टू फ्लैट फाइल स्ट्रक्चर शेयर यू कैन यू नो नीड टू क्रिएट हियर योर रिकॉर्ड डेफिनेशन एंड फील्ड डेफिनेशन एवरीथिंग ओके जस्ट गो टू योर प्रॉपर्टी सिलेक्ट दी ऑप्शन एज अ सेट ओके हियर यू कैन यू नो योर डिक्शनरी सो सिलेक्ट योर डिक्शनरी हियर नेक्स्ट then select your record definition to use as a default record select and finish okay so once you done with your flat file schema then click on the book flat file schema and then click on here okay now the document got a created okay so let me show you the document see flat file dictionary first then schema and then dt dt is my document okay now this is correct or not how you can identify how you can recognize for that purpose we required a one service so just right click new and create one service so i'll give the name as a book flow service then finish so empty flow got created then i'll take one sequence try try catch uh, try catch block error handling you can say so first sequence always main block always exit on a success and this is a parent sequence and another sequence would be your try block this is child sequence no right give a comment as a try block okay then the third sequence okay below your main sequence then it always exit on a this is a catch block basically always exit on a done so any business related logic you can mention in try block any error occur in try block it directly jump to catch block and that we need to invoke one get last error with the help of you can get a error details information last execution last flow execution error details you can see in a catch block so we'll mention as i earlier i told you you can mention your business logic so i'll invoke one service here wm flat file this is your basic package for a flat file related records a flat file related issues a flat file related services so wm flat file pub folder you can see here flat file then convert to values so whatever flat file you have we need to convert into a flat file ya yeah, is document so very first we required one input output here so just take one string ff it save it so that you can see the pipeline okay ff data got implicitly mapped to ff data why because the data structure yeah you can say the data type and uh, lamp space is same that's why it got directly mapping and ff values you need to drop ff data we don't required you can drop it and ff values here you can created one dt document so just drag and drop give the name as a book and map ff values to book save it like map it and save now here you can check anything is uh, like unwanted but you can drop it otherwise you can keep as is now you can run okay here cache block we required need to invoke one service get last error so i already invoke in last demonstration so i just select and invoke here okay now the next step would be save the demo and you can run it value like we have a flat file so just copy the data for conversion then okay share we got some error last error is couldn't find a flat file schema 
service exception okay so go to your service like in bit service go to pipeline here we fail to identify the like mentioned the ff schema here so do one thing copy this schema here and ff schema then paste it here and then okay. save and then try to run okay now you can see the output in front of you record with no id okay delimiter you can mention like you can see here after that we have a record 0 1 2 3 okay and if schema you can see here so guys that's all about today's demonstration okay so here we saw how you can create a dictionary as well as schema as well as a service okay so if you like this video then guys please subscribe to my channel like share and comment and if you have any query please do let me know in the comment section we will see you in the next workshop so till the time stay happy stay connected thank you so much